What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Raspberry Pi image on desktop or laptop PC. For example, if you can't afford Raspberry Pi or you just want to try operation system before investing into Raspberry Pi, you can follow the steps in the videos and have Raspberry Pi on your PC. To begin, we need to open our internet browser and then we'll have to go to this website and I'll put link in the description below and we'll have to download Raspberry Pi image and then we'll have to download Rufus to create bootable USB flash drive. So on here, I'm going to choose the latest 2021 and then in here, we'll have to download ISO file 2.9 gigs. So just click on it and then it start downloading. And then while it's downloading, we need to go to Rufus and then in here we need to scroll down and then we need to download Rufus. I'm just going to use portable version and that's it. Now we just have to wait until Raspberry Pi image is going to download. Once the download is complete, we can minimize this window and now we need to navigate to our download folder. And before we're going to start on Rufus, we need to plug in our flash drive into our computer. And since ISO file is about three gigs big, we have to have at least four gig flash drive, then double click on Rufus. Once this window is going to appear, you can just click on no. And then in here, we have to select our USB flash drive. And then right here, click on select and then navigate to downloads and then choose your Raspberry Pi OS image and then click on open and that's it. Leave everything else as default and then click on start. If you get this message right here, we need to click on yes. Basically, it's going to download new version of Sys Linux. Just click on yes. And then in here, we're going to leave everything as default. We're going to press OK. And then last message stating all the data is going to be destroyed. So if you have any data on your flash drive, it needs to be backed up. Otherwise, everything will be erased and then press OK and then press OK one more time. And now we're just going to have to wait until it's going to create Raspberry Pi bootable flash drive. Once your Raspberry Pi USB drive is created, you can click on close here and then you can safely eject your drive. Plug in your flash drive into the computer, the one you're going to convert to Raspberry Pi operation system and then power on your computer and on the startup, press F12 or F8 to boot into the boot menu. Every computer could be different. And then in here, we need to choose our USB and minus top one USB HDD and then press on enter. And in here, we need to choose graphical install and then press enter. Now in here, we need to choose our language and then press on continue. And in here, if you're going to get this screen, we can press on no and then click on continue. And then in here, I'm going to leave everything as default. I'm going to use the entire disk and then continue. Then I'm going to leave the top option because this is my SSD drive and then click continue. Same thing here again. I'm going to leave everything as default and then continue and then continue one more time. Then once you get here, we need to set to yes, continue. Once you get to the screen, leave everything as default as well and then click on continue. Then right here, we need to choose our hard drive and mine is Intel SSD and then click continue. And then when you get this message stating installation is complete right here, we need to click continue. And that's it. Once your system reboots, it boots into Raspberry Pi image or Raspberry image. And now you can start using and learning Raspberry Pi without having to purchase Raspberry Pi. If this video was helpful to you, press that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.